Mayday! Mayday! Can anyone read me? This is Keiko Necton of the Aranax. We're close. What's your situation? We're in a research vessel, stuck at the bottom of the sea! Please, help! <laughs> We should be right on top of them. We're running out of air! We can't find you. Huh? If this is a practical joke, someone has way too much time on their hands. Something big is coming. Help! Please! You just have to! I'm, I'm so small! No, no, no! I'm so awfully frightened! Huh? I need selfless, stupid, gullible, do goody heroes to come save me! <laughs> the Dark Orca. Captain Hammerhead. <laughs> Hello, Lectons! My family are explorers. We have been for generations. While others look up to the stars, we know there are an infinite number of things that shine in the darkness below. There are things lurking in the seas that long ago vanished into men. My family are explorers, and we explore the deep. Get back to the Aranax and call for help. We'll draw them away. Beat them to the air next. They're almost on top of us. There. Whoa. What? They're getting away. Back this vessel up right now. Come on, we're nearly there. Aranax looks safe and sound. Kids, open the moon pool and let us in. And? Fontaine? Attention, Nectons! We have your children! Surrender now! Oh, no. Fools! You thought you could escape the dreaded dark orca? I'm pretty sure pirates need to be at least four feet tall before they can be called dreaded. I'm a great pirate! Please, you don't even look like a pirate. Where is your eye patch? And don't get me started on your complete and utter lack of a parrot. I had a parrot, but he flew away. To a better pirate? <laughs> oh, hey! Ah! And stop antagonizing the pirates. Ooh, good advice. Where's the treasure? What treasure? Don't act stupid, Nectons. The word is out. He found something. Something rare and valuable. Something ancient with strange symbols. I want it! I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, maybe they're talking about the long <laughs> It looks like you want to play the hard way. Good. We like the hard way. Smiling friend, you and your sister deal with the kids. Whoa. Talk, land lover! <laughs> Happy to. I'm great at talking. In fact, Fontaine's always telling me I talk too much, if you can believe it. But I mean, how much is too much? Is it talk about the secret treasure? You'll have to be more specific about this treasure. Uh, maybe I could talk to your parrot. Except you don't have one. You know, once we get onto your sub, we'll find it anyway. We just thought if you talked, we wouldn't need to rip it to pieces. Oh well, back to plan A. Leave him. What do we do now? We find a way out. Every square inch of the Aranax's hull can withstand tons of pressure. It won't have any trouble withstanding a few pirates. Fine. If we can't get inside, I'll just take the whole thing. Call the Aranax back to base. We'll crack it open, take whatever we want, then add it to our mighty fleet. How many ships are in this mighty fleet of yours? 
Well, with a foreign accent, it'll be two. something I've never heard before. Still, that should keep our annoying siblings entertained for a while, right? We don't have a treasure. If we do, nobody's told me about it. Yeah, well, even if you're telling the truth, half the fun of a treasure hunt is the hunt. Uh, my dad loves this stuff. You don't? That's the family business, you know? Some kids become doctors or accountants. I had to become a pirate. Shouldn't you be demanding answers from me or something? Probably, but honestly, it's just nice to talk to someone who doesn't use the word R as punctuation. R guidance! Let's see how you do without your guidance system! Yeah! Huh? The guidance system's offline! We're sailing blind! What? How? Oh, I think I can guess. Yeah, you really shouldn't have brought our kids on board. That can't be good. Hey! You're locking me in here? Sorry, but you're holding us prisoner. Maybe don't do that next time. Wow! I think you make a better pirate than me! Can't you do something about that blinking alarm? <laughs> Stop that! Oh! It's the terrible pirate! I didn't hear you coming because none of your limbs are made of wood. What have you done? Oh, nothing too bad. So far, I've turned off the guidance system, disabled sonar, and turned up the volume on the alarm so they're annoyingly loud. <laughs> hey, be careful. <laughs> the engines are stopping. What did you do? I didn't do anything. It was all you. Liar. You wanted to sabotage our ship. Not this much. Can't they ship up right now? The engines are dead, Captain. What? Nitkan, can you sub-support our weight? Maybe, if we were on board to pilot. But we're stuck in here with you. I don't know. She tricked me and then disappeared. Ah! Finn, we're sinking, and it's all his fault! Come on, we gotta find Dad. Uh... The engines won't restart. The propeller shaft is completely jammed, and our ballast is blown. We can't refloat. We've got to get off this sub now! Oh, nonsense. We're fine. Then what's that sound? That probably whale noise, is it? How much pressure can the orca take? Ha! Ah, you think I'm gonna give up the dark orca's weaknesses that easily? Get out there, you useless lumps, and get the prop over again! What am I paying you for? You haven't paid us in weeks, Captain. What if they can't fix it? Ooh, you call them a crew incompetent! You did just call them useless lumps. Let us return to the Aranex. We can save everyone. Save yourselves, you mean? Why would we abandon the Orca? Our kids are on board. Oh, that's right. They are. And they're staying on board. Fine, go. But you have to take Mad Madeline with you. I don't want my daughter going down with this ship. What? I'm not leaving the Dark Orca. Finn, lead him out of here. Madeline, you have to go. If anything were to happen to you, you are a true treasure. Huh? Okay, they're gone. <laughs> Do you think they fell for it? Absolutely. People like them love sentiment and stuff. Here, take this. Make trouble. Find out what they're hiding on there, so. Whoa. Whoa! Oh no.
perfect. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Oh, hey guys. Ant! Is Fontaine okay? I don't know. I haven't seen her. You ain't supposed to be here! I heard your crew talking. Your prop is jammed. If you let me head out in this night, I can get it moving again. You sure you can get it working? I'm sure this is your best chance. Okay, do it. What are you waiting for? You scared? I'm looking for the claw that puts your vehicles in the water. What? You don't have a claw? How do you get stuff in and out of this? Ah! I like the claw better. How strong is that cable? How would I know? I'm just a kid. You think my dad will be okay? We'll use the Aranax to pull your ship out of danger. He'll be fine. I need my sister in the night to help. There's no way she's leaving the sub. <sighs> then I need you in that night. You seem to have forgotten who the captain is around here. I ain't taking orders from a keg. You can do what I say, or you can sink to your doom. What's wrong? I'm just saying. Uh, Careful, I consider it to be two options. Okay, Danny boy. Buy your grappling hooks. <laughs> Grab those cables. Oh, ain't the kind of vehicle I'm used to. <laughs> we nearly there. Ah. What do I do now? You guys really need a claw. That cable's not gonna hold much longer. I can't find a place to hook these. There's nowhere on the outside of the Aranax either. How about on the inside of the Aranax? Fontaine? How did you... Wow, you really do make a better pirate than me. We can attach these in the moon pool. Really? You think you can arrange that? Mom? Dad? Fontaine! Oh, it's good to hear your voice. We need the moon pool open. On it. Mr. and Mrs. Necton, I want you to know that your daughter stole one of our suits. What? Yep, you raised a common thief. Ugh, just ignore him, Mom. Try and concentrate, pirate boy. <laughs> Smooth, steady movements. More like a gymnast. Less like an octopus that's being electrocuted. <laughs> Easy, does it? We fix this, you'll leave us alone, right? You have my word. Let's get to it. <laughs> okay. Quickly, attach them to the edge before we get pulled out with them. The cables are in place. Let's just hope they hold. Uh, the cables are holding. For now. Did you hear that, Madeline? Your ship and your crew are going to be just... Where is she? Nowhere good. What do we have here? Ha, ha, ha. 
treasure. Another disaster successfully averted. Okay, you're not allowed to talk anymore. No! And the cables are gone. Power those propellers. I'm on it. Go, go! Come on, harder! This is still no good, Captain. I can't get any thrust. Propulsion to full. Yes, come on. I'd put that down if I were you. Gently. I wasn't stealing it. I... Accidentally slipped and unlocked a highly sophisticated safe. Yes. That. Will, we've got more trouble. What are you doing? We saved you. Fontaine, I don't like doing this, but I'm a pirate. My dad's the captain, and orders are orders. You don't even like being a pirate. It's all I know. Hey! You lied to me. You said you let us go. I say a lot of things. Out of my way, boy! Go! I'm coming, Fontaine. Just hang on. It's okay, Dad. I've got an idea. Fontaine! These guys don't even have a claw, remember? Okay, let's not do anything rash with the giant claw. No! You should leave everything rash to me! Fontaine, drop me! Now! Close the moon pool! What are you doing? That alarm's telling you that I just disrupted your oxygen supply. You've got around two minutes to come on board the Aranax peacefully, or we can leave you out here. Uh, hello? Uh, oh, uh, I'm just carefully considering me two options. Dad! Finn! You, your children, and your crew are leaving. Aunt? Or what are you doing? You'll need this. Bye-bye! <gasps> Look, I'm sorry about... You can be sorry, or you can be a pirate. You can't be both. Goodbye, Finn. That's taken a long time to download. Maybe they weren't lying. Maybe they really don't have a treasure. Oh, they've got a treasure, all right. Oh, <laughs> what is that? Oh, it looks like an entire scroll of treasure maps. I know, those lying do-gooders. <laughs> now we know what they have. Now we know exactly what to take from them. <laughs> Fontaine, until the moment he completely and utterly betrayed us, 
You seem to be getting along swimmingly with Smiling Finn. What's that supposed to mean? Mm, nothing. This whole thing should be a warning for all of us. We do need to be more cautious about... Let me guess, another distress signal? Yep. And we're gonna blindly rush in to help? Of course we are. This is the Aranax. We see your beacon. What's the problem? 